was the story profile on the news. Okay, I believe we've recovered your bicycle. Alby Roan already had his bike helmet on when the sheriff's deputy pulled up to his house. The 11-year-old knew he was about to get back on a very special set of wheels. His brother says ever since the three-wheeler was stolen last Saturday for the second time, Alby has had high hopes for its return. Because he'd wake us up every morning and run the window and see if it was there. Well, when he first got it, the community bought it for him, or got it for him. Because his other bike got stolen, so everybody knows. And I don't know why somebody wanted to steal from a little kid like him, you know, from anybody. The brothers banded together on a search, but the bike never turned up. And then we looked behind Albertsons and down Pelham and just about everywhere. You didn't see it? Nope. Robbie Waters also knew about the missing bike and called the sheriff's department when he discovered it in some nearby woods. We received lots of calls on the bicycle. And like you said, we had a lot of people want to call in and buy him a new one. So mm -hmm. luckily he got the one that he wanted. Yeah, I was hoping that somebody would call or find it or, you know, because he needs a bike. He needs a bad. LB has cerebral palsy and needs the bike to build up his leg muscles. And now that it's back, so is LB's smile. Yeah, whoever he is, I thank you very much. In Fort Walton Beach, Molly Mangelsdorf, Emerald Coast News.